In order to access many of the node tricks, you first need to go into Preferences, Add-ons, and then search for the Node Wrangler, and then make sure to enable it. And under Themes, you can also change the look of the node connections. So let's go to the Node Editor settings. And then if you look a bit closer and change the nodal curving, you can see that it becomes more curved. So uh, set it to whatever you want to. And then we can take a look at the different tricks. Now, let me just set up two nodes before I show you the first trick. So let's connect the noise texture to the color. And then I'm going to add a color ramp. And then from this color ramp, we can create a new connection by holding in shift and right click drag. And then we can connect that one to another node as well, like this. So by holding in shift and right click dragging, you can very easily tidy up your node setup in Blender. And then next, we can take a look at the many other shortcuts. And you can access these by pressing shift W and there we can see many shortcuts, and I'm going to show you some of them. So let's start off by selecting this noise texture, and then press Ctrl T. And then it automatically sets up the texture coordinates and the mapping for that texture. You can hold in the Ctrl and right click drag to cut the connection, and then you can press F to connect these nodes again. Another useful trick for nodes is to select some nodes and then press Shift P to frame the nodes. By naming and categorizing the nodes and the node connections, you can make the node setup more easily understandable, both for yourself and for others. So you can give it a name and you can change the color, as well as changing the size and label size of the frame. Another way to make your node setup less messy is to select some nodes and then press Ctrl G to group those nodes. So that when you press tab again, you can see that we now only have one node for those two nodes. And if you want to add PBR textures, you can just select a principal node and then press Ctrl Shift T, select some textures and it's automatically going to set up the nodes for you. And that's it for this video. Make sure to subscribe to my channel for more Blender content.